So today uh, broke a, or excuse me, tied a record in McAllen. We hit 107 and around this time. We're normally about 98 degrees, but our record was 107 back in 2017. 2017 was also when we set the record in Harlingen at 103. And today we reached 102 out there. Brownsville hit 99 degrees and their record is 102. And that was in 8. 1978. Now today all the heat advisories are done, but tomorrow we have another heat advisory in effect from 12 to 7 for the entire RGB. If you notice, we don't have uh, that extreme heat warning in effect that uh, has uh, not taken over because our heat index doesn't show that we should be above 115 or more. Our temperatures, though, still going to feel like it. 103 in Harlingen for tomorrow, 99 in uh, Olmito, 98 degrees in Browns. We look out towards Willis County temperatures out there. 104 in Raymondville, 103 in Lyford in Hidalgo County should be at around 105 in McAllen and Mission. 107 out towards La Jolla and then in Star County we're looking at temperatures at around 109 in Rio Grande City and Roma. We take a look at South Padre Island for tomorrow. We should be at around 88 degrees. The thing is it's going to be very hot out there. Rip current risk moderate with a with choppy conditions out towards the bay. Your high tide at 1034 a.m. for the weekend should be at around 87 degrees on Saturday and 88 degrees on Sunday. Now, I do want to take a look at the tropics. There's been an update out there for that second area that we've been watching. We saw Tropical Storm Brett that makes its way out towards the west. But we look at this area right behind it now has a 80% chance over the next two days and a 90% chance over the next five to seven days of it developing into a stronger storm. And should it develop, Cindy would be the next name on the list. And folks, very unfortunate unprecedented that we have two storms building off the coast of Africa, especially out so far towards the east in June at this time, and especially back to back. Usually that first one takes up all the energy. Now we look at your seven day forecast 102 on Thursday, 100 degrees on Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Now, very, very hot out there. But remember, even though we get that little bit of dip, humidity ramps back up for the weekend, and that will make it feel much hotter. That means that our heat index will be back up one more time and I fully expect that we could see more watches, more warnings picking up as we go through the next few days, but hot conditions lasting with your lows staying in the upper 70s, low 80s.